In this video, we're going to talk about how to connect your tripod and your camera together. The tripod comes in this nice bag. You're going to unzip it from the top and pull the tripod out. The tripod consists of several different parts. There is your head, your feet, and then the actuating levers here. First thing we're going to do is open the tripod by pulling it out. You'll see this base comes out here. Then by pulling up on the buttons, you're able to pull down the legs to extend. Push the button back in to lock the leg in place. And your tripod is set up. Now, if you want it taller, you then can use the levers on the top to pull and lengthen the tripod. Now that the tripod is up and set, let's talk about getting the camera on top and the head. So first thing you'll notice is at the top, there is a level button. You're gonna to wanna to make sure that that dot is in the center. So by adjusting any of the feet, you can adjust where that dot is and make sure that you have a level camera tripod. This will be important when you are trying to get that perfect shot and it's just not quite working out. It's most likely because uh, your tripod is not level. Okay, so now my tripod is level for the ground that I'm working on. Next, you'll see the head. The head rotates side to side, moves up and down to adjust the camera. And then underneath here, there is a knob. This knob makes the camera go all sorts of craziness. If your camera um, is needing to be more fine tuned and level, you're going to untwist this, move the camera head around until it is completely level. If you can't get it with your legs and then tighten that up. Now we're ready to attach our camera. Taking the camera out of its case, you'll see on the bottom of the camera, there is a quick release plate already on. So no screwing involved. What you're going to do is set the camera on top of the tripod, facing down away from the quick release notch. As you push down on the back side, the quick release notch will pull in and lock the camera on place. Now you're good to go. If your camera is wobbly and kind of moves a little bit, adjust the levers on the left-hand side to stop that movement going on. If you want a more fluid move, you're going to need to adjust these until they're exactly at the level that you want them. Once you have all that done, your camera is set up on its tripod, ready to go. To remove the camera from the tripod, you're going to grab the lever on the bottom, pull it towards you, lift the camera out and away. That's going to unlock the camera base and you're good to put this back in the bag. Don't ever set the camera down on the ground as the base on the bottom can make it a little bit of flimsy and can cause some problems. Once that's in the bag, you're good to fold this down. Release all the levers that you set up in the beginning. Collapse those legs and your tripod is put away and ready to go for next time. Place it back in the bag, feet first. Zip up the bag. And you're done. You've got your tripod all put away, ready to go.